What's up guys? Back again with another movie review and it's going to be another animated movie. This movie is called Lewis and the Aliens. It came out in 2018. Good little movie so let's start here. Now again I'm bad with names so the cast is always gonna take a hit. So I remember I do have my trusty little notes I am not a professional, and I don't play one on TV, so I use notes. So let's do this. It stars Caleb Maloney as Louis Sontag. It stars Dermont Magnus as Armin Sontag, and the voice of Wabu, or Wabu. We have Ian Coppinger, or Copping, Coppinger as Mog, and Will Forte as Nag, and there are many other, uh, many other uh, casts in there, and voices, and all that, you know how animated uh, movies are, there's a dozen people in there with a dozen different voices going on, so that's all we're going to do as far as that goes. So as far as the story, Lewis is a young boy growing up. In a single parent household after his mom dies. His dad, Armin, is a ufologist. Strange name. Strange. Strange. Yeah. Trying to prove aliens exist and has no real time for Lewis. Bad dad. Bad. Soon, our three aliens join the fun as they make their way to Earth. A fun story unfolds, but first the school principal feels Lewis is not being raised properly and should be taken to a boarding school. That's just kind of a quick summary of the story, don't want to give too much away. That's just the basic of the story. So let's get on to my thoughts, my comments, etc. I was surprised to find this little gem. I found myself quickly entertained, and although the story itself isn't totally unique, I found it flowed well, and it did its job. The three aliens were funny, and each have their own silly personality. You know how these movies are with comedy, especially these animated flicks. They all got to have that certain kind of comedy aspect in there. And it works. It does, it does its job pretty well. The struggle with Lewis and his dad, I'm sure, will hit home with many boys and men alike. Yeah, it does. Without giving too much away, there are other alien surprises and a good overall bad versus good experience throughout and at the end you'll see the animation is well done the actors voicing the characters really fits and seems natural the musical score is perfect throughout uh, it's your basic basic uh musical score through there with the highs and lows and the and the all that good stuff i'm glad i stumbled upon this animated flick i have to give it a solid four out of five easy it was well done uh and again uh along with the other review that i did of ozzy the animated movie it's one of those that I never really heard of. Uh, I don't know if it got a whole lot of attention. A whole lot of media buzz. Like some of these other ones seem to get. But uh, sometimes those movies are the best. Or are at least worth a watch. Um, same thing with uh, any movie. Or any TV show. Sometimes it's not the ones that are uh, with the biggest budgets and, and the most promotions and all that. But it's the ones that kind of slide under the radar. So I recommend you check it out. It is a, a very good movie. I think 
I think kids will like it, adults will like it. I enjoyed it. So, yeah, that's my review. I hope you enjoyed it. And remember, I appreciate you watching my videos. Uh, I hope you subscribe, watch, like, comment, share, all that good stuff. Remember, I do this for free. Uh, there's no monetization. There's no ad that I'm aware of. Um, I do it for the love of it. I really enjoy doing these things along with all my other videos that I do. So, uh, yeah, I hope someone gets some inspiration from everything that I do and uh, enjoys your day and you can turn your life around somehow and start your own adventure. So I'm out of here. Don't forget you can get up, get out, get red, and do it to it even when doing a movie review. We'll see you guys later.